Hi, this is your spiritual nugget for today. In winter or during the cold season, trees lose more leaves than in other seasons. But why do they have to lose more leaves during winter than in other seasons? You see, during the cold season, the underground water, it freezes to such an extent that the tree is unable to pull it up its trunk. So, therefore, the tree has to survive on limited amount of water for the rest of the season. The tree leaves, they need more water. They use more water and they lose more water through the process called transpiration. So for the tree to minimize its water losses, it then drop its leaves or loses its leaves so that it doesn't lose a lot of water. For the tree to see the next season, it must lose its leaves and compromise its beauty. You know, in life, there is a season of loss. That season is so inevitable that you need to go through it in order to see the next life cycle or the next life season. Everyone has lost something in life, be it finances, assets, friends, parents, spouses, through death or divorce. Those are all painful losses that we suffer. In the Bible, Job lost everything that he had. But in chapter 42 of the book of Job, God replaces everything that Job lost during his winter season. And God did not only replace what Job had or what he lost, but he also gave him a double portion of everything that he lost. So if God doesn't replace your losses in this life, you need to rest assured that he will replace your losses in the life to come or with eternal life. In the book of Matthew, chapter 10, verse 39, Jesus says, He who finds his life will lose it. And he who loses his life, for my name's sake, will find it. In this verse, Jesus is not only referring to losing your life through death for his sake, but he is also referring to losing opportunities, networks, associations, friends, all those connections, fame, that can make or put you in a better position to be a successful man or a successful person. If you lose all those things for his sake, then Jesus will reward you in the summer season. And in this case, the summer season is the eternal life. It is the time that will start immediately when he appears in the east when he comes to fetch or to take home all his children and all the saints who have done his will. This is the Advent Shofar sounding the gospel trumpet to a sin-stricken world.